So is x not equal to y? A fine question. Um, so uh, in statement one, we find out that x plus y is greater than zero. Well, you know, if we say that um, x equals one and y equals one, um, those two together are greater than zero, but x is equal to y, so the answer would be no. If we pick x equals two and y equals one, x plus y is greater than zero, and the answer is yes, the two are not equal. So when it's sometimes yes, sometimes no, to a yes, no question, the statement is insufficient. It's not A and it's not D. Statement two tells us that X times Y is less than zero. Um, in order for X times Y to be less than zero, um, one of the two numbers has to be negative. If they're both positive, X times Y would be positive. If they're both negative, X times Y would be positive. So um, x, y less than zero, that means x and y are either positive, negative, or negative, positive. If they have different signs, they can't possibly be equal. No matter what number you pick uh, for x and no matter what you pick for y, uh, if one of them is positive and one of them is negative, they're not the same number. So statement two is sufficient on, us, on its own for us to determine that x is not equal to y.